Wow, man. Talk about getting your mutant buzz on. Come to you high atop Indica Springs, Colorado. And I mean high. <laughs> and no authority field home of the Mile High Chronic. Just bought some of those brownies at the Get Bake Sale. Man, these guys can bake up here. I can hear colors, Grim. Hey, Grim, order me one of them corned beef and hash oil sandwiches. I got the munchies something bad. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Los Scandalous Volts take on the Mile High Chronic. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's a beautiful day for MFL football, at least in the booth with the AC, personal servants, and blood shield. Hi, Grim Blitzer here with you, along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. How are you guys doing? I'm doing that little hottie who works at deep fries the concessions. He said how, not who, you idiot, even if you got the answer right. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Oh, the strawberry field's dirty trick. As my mentor Hunter used to say, I don't advocate drug. You've got to catch that. Third down and, well, good luck. And he just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting or dead or worse. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he's got a chance for a good return here. That, my friends, was an all pro NFL hit. Oh my God, a man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Okay, good man, Kim. Kim, on up. Get him out. Get him out. And it's first and ten. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. He's leaving a 
a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is lukewarm. And he's proud of that. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. And the defense was reading him like a book. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when it's... And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. <laughs> I know, I hate those zebra men. <laughs> and it's first and goal. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well. Wow. And it's first and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Third down and nine. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. I hope you covered your ears, Brick, because that was a son of Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brave Man with a ball and didn't fall out.
Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down and long. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Second down and ten. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. Second down and ten. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up third and one. <laughs> well, here comes the punting unit. A fake punt! If you can't trust a punter, who can you trust? He broke free and has open field in front of him. Does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Uh, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. There's no reason to go. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Nice punt. Should move them back. Nice, nice catch. And he turns on the afterburner. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. are caked in blood and guts and he's looking to score and it's first and ten four yards on that one and he was just starting to pick up some speed hey Grim I know a guy if that's what you're after second down and six Excuses for this QB. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. He's at the 40. The 30. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next?
And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. First and ten. This guy's a brick shit house. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the rep didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. First and ten. And when the coach said the offense was going to be explosive this week, the ref that just called that penalty, he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That sounds like a good job. He's right at home here taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swiping money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that? Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And another interception. This quarterback is gonna... Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my offseason. First and ten. And this guy looks like Thor on a revenge. Oh, the receiver has to make that catch. Now I put the... And it looks like we've got a penalty here. First and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to... Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Another hit a man when he's down. He's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And it's first and ten. Looks like a pass and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. Second down and a lot. The warning sounds only two minutes left in the first half. Second down and more than the QB would like. Yeah, you 
You think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Uh, why are they stopping the clock for the offense, Grim? They're stopping it for their own offense. They're hungry for the ball, partner. The ball? The pitch game? Bacon! I'm hungry for bacon! Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, then. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. Second down in a very lot. And the defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. And timeouts are kind of like condoms, you know, Grim? You got to use them smart if you want to score. Let's see if they did. Third down and three. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And it's first and ten. Quarterback drills one in. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Uh, we are, Grim. Uh, and he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, it's almost poetic, Grim. comes the extra point attempt. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? And at this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB... Whoa, that is one big mutant sandwich down there. One guy's definitely toast. That's what you call a club sandwich, Grim. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. First and ten. No receivers open, so the QB just threw the ball away. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Hey, a sawbuck says he misses. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. At the end of 
quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries, makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. We're back for the second half in a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. Well, the game is as close as the score indicates. <laughs> Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Quick pass picks up maybe two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. He's not going down. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, that hit's going to shave a... Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. The offense has no running backs left, so they will lose all running plays in their playbook. And it's first and ten. Ah, another interception. Jeez. Oh, did he take a punishing hit? You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? Yeah, and the waitress at the Boo Hooters Chicken Wings last night? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and then, then the police horse is out front in the stadium earlier. It was just a joke slap, but the horse took it seriously. Not surprised. Oh, man, he really wants it. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This the ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. And it's first and ten. No, you didn't. You know why? Because I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Seriously, man, you think you'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. <laughs> 
Second down and long. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. And he breaks away. First down. He was not going to drop that one. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. And it's first and ten. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense. Oh, he just got popped big time. Oh my god, I thought his head was gonna pop off like a big zip. And it's first and ten. The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver. He broke free and has open field in front of him. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. He just got crushed. See that boo, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> and it's first and ten. I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my offseason. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? And it's first and ten. And catch for a new game. Then how is it a pass? Second down and ten. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run.
And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And it's first and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. First down and three. Whose eyes the QB? Boom! Dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, I'm still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close though. Yep. First down and six. set up the offense looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life he is but he's got no choice oh the unstoppable force meets the explodable object the burn returner was killed on that play the coach will replace him with another player and it's first and ten Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. You ever have a bottle of hot sauce shoved up your ass? Quite the description of that painful hit, Junior. Huh? No, no, it's a question here on this online dating profile. It doesn't say if on purpose or by accident. Yeah, I'll leave it blank. And it's first and ten. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Third down and the punter is warming up. Oh, and the 
quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match stopsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gun. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Brim. Oh, a great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man, the defense is going to have more. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? I don't even get Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And he's running like a moose right now. And it's first and ten. And the QB might as well just bury himself now because this guy's... And that's an incomplete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. Uh, I didn't want to grab the receiver like that. He could get hurt. Second down and ten. At this rate, the QB's going to have more interceptions than... Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. But my watch is a bit slow. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. That's a catch for a one yard gain. That's not going to do it, fellas. Second down and nine. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo. First and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. He could go all the way. And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run! And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time.
second down in a lot. Great chance for a big gain. But still not enough for a first. Even I'm frustrated, and I'm a team agnostic. First down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. Oh, man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and hit. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. First and ten. They've used a strawberry field. And that's it. He refuses to go down. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry. Up. It's called a zap attack. The ball carrier better move his ass out of bounds before he gets... I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? <laughs> he broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. The 10. It's a touchdown! <laughs> Move, baby. No, you didn't. You know why? I'm not too fast. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They just be. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. <laughs> Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have... Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. And it's first and ten. It's a bomb kill right in someone's face. This your first time playing the game? Hey, you with the controller in your hand. I'm talking to you. Second down and ten. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else come by. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. First down. The ref that just called that penalty, he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That sounds like a good job. He's right at home here taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swipe the money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that? And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Touchdown! And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done! I can't run like that unless it's coupon night and time to hell. He has better footwork though than me on account of not clenching his cheeks.
Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. He'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. And he's off to the races. He's at the 10. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and 10. They quickly call a timeout, hoping to save some time for their offense. And it's first and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row. And it's first and ten. And I'm not sure who he was throwing to on that play. Second down and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Oh, oh come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. <laughs> and the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brit's match stopsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well. Hey, man. You see that? That's right. You can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. Perfect kick and recovery by the kicking team. The Mile High Chronic lose the game. The score says it all, but it wasn't even that close. They got blown out at home. Fans left by halftime to forget the game and start watching the new Game of Bones on NBO. You know, I watched that on my phone, too. Oh, let's go down to the field and see how badly the MVP rubs it in. with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.